Audre Lorde is a poet, novelist, activist, and mother of two. She grew up in Harlem in the 1930s. She's the author who coined a term biomythography in her seminal book, Zamni, a New Spelling of My Name. Audre Lorde defined biomythography as a literary form that blends elements of autobiography, the novel, and personal mythology. Lorde was a critic of second wave feminism helmed by white upper middle class leaders. She believed that gender oppression is inseparable from other forms of oppression. She similarly advocated for a multi-dimensional view of individual identity. Lord asserted that communities too are built of differences and that we should embrace difference. You need to begin with a movement, which is what Black Power and the Civil Rights Movement was. Then, immediately within it, you are going to get those people whose differences are not being articulated, which is, right, us. So then there is immediately another step. Typically, the basic structure for an autobiography is that you pick a story you want to tell, devise a quick timeline of events, divide events into subsections or chapters, add events and details to each section, conduct some contextual research, think about where you want to begin, choose a writing style, and then you begin writing. A biomythography weaves myth, history, and biography in epic narrative. Its job is to expand perceptions, exposing more multifaceted, dimensional, and mutable considerations of identity. Implementing biomythography as a studio practice provides a challenge to critical historical practices. We use multimediated and interdisciplinary platforms to investigate historical facts, life experiences, pop culture, and mythology, challenging, forming, and informing art history, display, anthropology, identity, and ritual, as well as personal, universal, and institutional perspectives and histories. Through developing a series of curatorial projects contextualizing the visual arts within biomythography, Wembley Christian work as context providers for critical dialect, addressing the nuances within ever-shifting identities and how we experience and create our contemporary world and culture.